Yeah. Really They'll just good, run uh, across the stage and smack you in the face and you're dead. Yeah. He has a really good Krom, really good Meta Knight, really good Falco. But he's mainly Roy. Roy's his best character, I think. I would love this to see a Meta Knight. This tournament is so stacked then if these guys. Because we, we, uh, I know, I saw Razo, I saw Master, I saw dude, Nico, Razo's I saw. There? Oh, dude, this term, it's a wrap, bro. This tournament's gonna be crazy. I don't know if he entered, but yeah. And, uh, Why would you show up here and not enter? Uh, I know he's player. come and just done many matches. He does that sometimes for big tournaments. Um, I think Razo should see. definitely enter because he literally has won MSN before over like half these players. It just would be like so silly to be here. And he's like, oh yeah, I can beat all these guys in grand finals right now, but you know, I'm gonna money match Jimmy one, two, three instead. But yeah, anyway, maybe it's a maybe he's figured out that he can make more money money match. That's probably not true. Yeah, I would, I, I agree with it. How can we can't hear the game? It's kind of weird. I don't know. I can hear Excuse it. Me. No, I can't. I'm just hey, trying to mess with you. You can't hear the game. All right, so we have Snake and Roy here. Oh, AC okay. sticking. Both of these players sticking with their mains. All right, that's fine. Okay. So, I don't know, taking that combo just. I mean, it's clear he's labbed that out. He cut right back to the edge. Yeah, I like watching characters like Combo Will versus Snake because they just like abuse his disadvantage state so hard. But I also like watching Snake set up too. It was just kind of like a good uh, battle between really good zoning and then just really good offense, you know? It's a good dynamic. I mean, what's interesting about Snake is I th the grenade adds an element to the, the punish game. Uh, you know, what, is he going to pull the grenade? Is he not? There's a, like another option there. So it, it makes the neutral and the punish game like pretty complex. Mm. Ooh. Jab backer, you already know that's going to be killing even heavy characters really soon. You're going to go high, of course. Okay, AC has not... Oh, nice. Still got the right turn. But yeah, AC has not mixed up his landing for a few times now. He's like did fear versus C4 grenade pull the past like three times. I don't know. That's just one thing about knowing how to juggle Snake is just getting a read on how they like to land. He, he can mix up all he wants, but if you know where he's going to go, you can... Still keep hitting him. Nice pivot yeah, cancel. Yeah. F tilt. That was slick. So good. Yeah, especially if you get the sweet spot F tilt with Roy too. So good. Oh, oh man, let me hit up on the C stick. What are you gonna do about this? Huh? What are you gonna do? What are you, what are you gonna do? Huh? Yeah, roll behind, but oh, I the feel thing like is got there. A punch yeah, there. the thing is, you roll behind, but he can actually punish you for rolling too. <laughs> It's kind of funny, like the whole thing is there, he makes the ledge so un like unsafe and scary that you want to panic roll, and then he just hits you with something for that. Yeah, he can just uh, up tilt you, right? Yep. And just take your stock. It's pretty funny. But I don't know, man, I've seen that sweet spot, uh, that crazy rage uh, flare, what? No, da double edge dance. Double oh, edge uh, dance, okay. yeah, from Roy. It's double edge dance from Roy, but dancing blade from Lucina and Mark. Is yes, that correct? That is correct. Oh my god, but he just got tackled. Then what's the one for Krom? Uh, I think it might also be double edge dance. I don't know. I don't know if Krom's moves that well. Like their actual names. I did not play. Uh, what's he from? Awakening. Fire Emblem. Yeah, Awakening. <laughs> Another pivot cancel left tilt. He's uh, gotten that like two times now, but every time was a trade. And I just think that he's like, all right, I know he's going to swing here and I know I'll get hit, but at least I'll take the stock. So, I don't know. It's rough. It's rough because you, you're you going to trade with Snake, even though you don't want it, like this situation over and over. But it's just kind of like a necessary evil sometimes, you know, because if you just don't hit him when you have opportunity because you're scared of trading, then you just let Snake set up the stage for free, you know. Nice uh, oh, another combo matters. off that grenade, or at least being able to opportunistly get that in there. Yeah, he respected the grenade pull too. Yeah. He didn't want to play too aggressive. Oh, no way. No, 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 no. If he DI'd off stage, that would have been horrible for him. <laughs> oh, just walk up up to it. Yeah. Oh. Dang, that was rough. Dude, my man just. No, let's not go there. 
walk up slowly and up tilt. There, I finished it for you. I mean, you, you already was leading us that direction. You might as well just commit to what you were gonna say. I was hoping you'd finish for finish it for me You're because welcome. I didn't want to say it. You're welcome. Who was? What was that set? It was a Ming. It's Mango Hacks or something? Yeah, Mango Hacks. And it was Scar and Toph. Well, I believe it was the match where, because Hacks was always saying, oh, Falcon sucks, I'm going to switch yeah. to Fog. So Mango switched to Falcon and went Hacks' colors. And yeah, then yeah, the, the ultimate disrespect. Yeah. I think Hacks had like a sub goal to play Falcon again, actually. Well, the funny part of that. Oh, later. Oh, Wait, no, 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 I forgot he it. has down B. Uh, no, the funny part of that is that Mango, Mango won that, or lost that set. <laughs> Oh, but no one remembers that. Nobody remembers that. They just that's, remember walk up slowly so, and down. <laughs> that must be so annoying. Keep your ass. Anyway, AC ended up under the stage on accident and took 106% for his trouble. Yeah, but, but he lived. And, you know, this actually doesn't really mean that much because he's a snake. snake. That's what like, I was going to say. <laughs> I think if AC instead just like raise like that up tilt when he knows uh, Sarah's gonna roll, he'll hit that. The down smash seems more strict to catch the roll after the up smash from yeah. Ledge. What makes Snake so hard to play against is that he's able to reset neutral so much, so many times, just because of his weight. You know, he's gonna live so much longer. You're gonna have to deal with these grenades, and that could be really taxing. But uh, for a character like Roy that has that kill speed and that, that speed and that kill power. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> I don't know. That must have been a missed input. I, dude, I want to say it was, but AC also goes for some crackhead plays like that. So. <laughs> some what? <laughs> you no, know, crackhead some plays. Tyro, some Tyrone Bigums plays? Sure, that's another way to put it. Either way. Can we say that? That's true. I can't. I guess we can't. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how to describe doing an upbeat <laughs> neutral with Snake, okay? You could just say he's uh, silly. He's being so silly. <laughs> anyway, no tech. Oh, of course, he's gonna tech. But uh, yeah, yeah, he was no. way past 160. That's guaranteed. I wish that that would just like choke you out <laughs> instead of just getting a free up tilt. Because that's what Snake would do. And we could have an animation of him. Another run of up tilt. Yeah, that's what you gotta really watch out for from Roy. It's so fast. Yeah, what he's doing a lot of times with you that can't is react uh, to it. he's timing it to when AC does the grenade pull, and then once he's like already committed to pressing the grenade, he's just already in his face. Mm -hmm. That's another good way to get grabs on Snake in general. When you know they're just gonna stay still and pull grenade, you just like get a grab, throw him before the grenade like blows up in your face. Oh. Okay, oh, this is another free so hit, much damage here. F smash? Oh, nice. That was good air dodge. grab. A disadvantage, though. Oh, man, that was a super unsafe dash attack, but uh, Cyro didn't. You know, oh, he's trying to catch it. the air dodge oh. there. Yeah, that was a super hard read. AC throws out at least one F smash per set. I've seen it multiple times now. Look, I mean, if you have a rocket launcher, you got to use it. Good patience. But who needs a rocket launcher when you can just... F tilt them with your sword. I don't understand how that move is so strong. Oh, it's the sword? Yeah. Why wouldn't it be strong? He hit the sweet spot. Yeah, but Snake has grenades. What? I don't know what Like, grenades are far more is. deadly than. It's okay. I guess it's like a fire sword with fire that puts you on fire. Going into game three, <laughs> we, we have AC counterpicking to Battlefield. What do you think about this pick, Strides? Amazing snake stage. He's like already going to live even longer than he usually does. He can mix up his landing on the platform really well. And then he has this, right? Look, he just he does this. He literally used to set up the grenade traps on the platform in the C4, so you can't really chase him as freely. Like, a lot of times people want to just like, oh, they're on a platform above me on Battlefield or whatever platform stage. That means I'm just going to pressure their shield aerials. But, like, Snake's just holding the grenade a lot of times. So you can't really safely do that. I don't know. The other thing is this, uh, it's kind of hard to take advantage of Snake and disadvantage on this stage as Roy. Like, maybe if he was a player character like Mario, that just, like, 
all these like five hundred stitches. We'll, we'll see though. So I feel like Cyro's kind of gotten used to the uh, flow of how he's supposed to be fighting AC Snake. He's not yeah, just he's running not really into as much as he's I'm actually really surprised I didn't kill him. Did Snake in battlefield privilege, honestly. Spot. It, it's still Snake, man. I know that move's strong, but Snake's really, really heavy. You know? And this is a, a wide horizontal blast on the stage. Just a big stage in general, yeah. Another uh, one. Yeah, get yep. that F till in there. Dude, like that's kind of like about. four kills like that. I don't know. I just think that uh, AC is not ready to react to that. It seems really hard to react to in general, especially if you're already committed to the point I think it's possible to react yeah. to it. It happens that so fast in this game. The amount of lag that uh, this game, I think it's like 10, 13 frames. It's just impossible to react to. I don't know. I have to look that up again. Yeah, I know we're living. Oh, I like that uh, invincible get up attack. Yeah, that was that was really smart. Dang, I, I, just, I just appreciate when people have a lead versus snake, and then they just don't swing anymore. <laughs> They're like, cool, just keep throwing things at me. I'll throw them back. Like, I don't have to trade you anymore. Yeah, it's a it's a risky game to play though because uh, if you mess up, you know you're you're suddenly in a bad spot. You're getting Ready, exploded by the Korea. And now AC, very happy to take that grenade of the. the Grenade explosion to get that kill. Dude, Cyro does not care about the grenades at all. <laughs> I like it, dude. I, I like how much he's walking in this match. Right now. A lot of people just get, I don't know, they, they see red versus snake and they just start holding forward, running into everything, like hitting like all, every single grenade. And Cyro's just like, nah, I'm not giving you any free trades. Another run up F2. Oh. Yeah, he's just waiting out this moment there. Paying off huge for him, but not getting that kill that time. Another one? Yeah, no, no, he's not, not dead. Quite. He didn't even trade the grenade this time. I was just really good spacing overall. Okay. I like that beer verse yeah, the I like the beer versus the grenade pull from ledge. That was really smooth from AC. Uh, at this point, yeah, AC's just trying to like trade as much as possible, get Roy to kill percent, find a way to come back. Oh, why do you. Uh, I, it looks like he intentionally, you know, did his up B like that to stall with the grenade off stage, but he threw the grenade before it could explode. I don't know. It's yeah, I don't know. Just some next level mind games here coming out from AC. He's, he's making some These questionable, snake players, questionable decisions. But it didn't matter because he just yeah, but immediately he stole that stock back. Perfect stock there yeah. from AC. And uh, it's even again. Yeah, good that, that he kept his, kept his composure after SDing really bad with that grenade pool. Yeah, that now, he, now he has a chance to actually you know, take the set. Well, Perry. Oh, man, he, didn't, he got a sour spot of the air, so he didn't get a hard enough combo that he would normally get. Oh, he was just right up in his face and waited all the way, actually. Nice. Up there. Fall through the platform up there. Wait, wait up the spot out. Yeah, yeah. Out. This is great. Man. Yeah, I like, yeah, the, I like the patience. Oh, oh we could have gotten a grab there. Or a Man, that was so risky to go for Nikita there. He does completely helpless. Cyro oh, clearly not expecting to be there. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Throw it up. Okay, then the green blew up first. And now, completely even game. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. I mean, both playing. of these characters have really strong kill power. Oh, oh my cool. god. He caught him dashing. Oh man! Well, he yeah he no. picked up the grenade there.